I often share my screen on Zoom and uh, I get the question, George, when you share your screen, we notice that you don't reveal the people uh, who are also part of the call for privacy purposes. So I want to show you how I do that. Now, I'm so grateful that I have two people on this call who don't mind me revealing them at first so I can show you what it's like normally. And then I will show you how I don't, uh, how I hide them. Okay, so let me first go ahead and share my screen so you can see how it normally looks, right? So I'm going to share uh, this particular window here. And uh, basically, um, <laughs> yeah, Heather, you can, you can, you can uh, wave, wave again. <laughs> so thank you, Heather and Vix, for being here and letting me record. And so, okay, I'm bringing everything into the recording window now. All right. So let's say I'm sharing this document. Um, and as usual, when you start screen sharing, whoever else is on the call will be on a strip on the right hand side, like Heather and Vix, you can see them. But a lot of people don't realize you can click on these little buttons above yourself. Okay. So first of all, let me actually one, one thing before I stop, before I start screen sharing, I usually, cause usually zoom is like this where it's gallery view. You see the, the, the three of us here. I usually first spotlight myself. So I spotlight myself for everyone. So now I'm on the main screen and then I share my screen and I'll do this one more time here. And my spotlighted video uh, is at the top, even when I minimize everybody else. So the, this, this button that I'm clicking on, the second button here on the, to the left is where I minimize everybody else, except for me as the spotlit video. Okay. Now, another thing a lot of people don't realize you can do and try these other buttons, right? This one shows everyone in a strip. And then this final video, the grid video shows everyone in a grid. I guess, uh, there's not, there's not enough people here to show as a grid, but there would be more people if there was. But anyway, let me show the, the, the show active speaker video. And a lot of people don't realize that you can drag your speaker video so that it's bigger. So let's say that you don't really need, and this is the maximum you can drag it actually the size. You don't need, uh, sometimes you don't need to, to show the details of something and you don't mind yourself being a bigger video while you maybe show some big image or something like that, um, on the, on the left hand side. I think it's going to be on the left. Let me now show you what it looks like when, when I have, uh, made that video bigger. So I'm going to, um, I'm going to continue my screen, uh, screen sharing here. And, uh, no, I'm going to go ahead and, um, sorry, I'm going to go ahead and show, show you something else on my screen. So this is, this is a video that I recorded, uh, with Gregory Bahani. And thank you, Gregory, for letting me show this. And I want to show you what happens when I, um, when I have made my, myself larger. So let me go ahead and, uh, okay. So Gregory, congratulations so, on, uh... so this is when me and Gregory were both spotlighted. <coughs> so I add, I, I've spotted myself and then I click on Gregory's video and click add spotlight. I'll show you that later. And then, um, what I happens is watch this later. Look, look at this. I have now shared my screen and you notice it's so weird. How come my video is so small up here? Why is there such a large empty area? You know why? Because later on in the video, I got smart and enlarged myself. I, 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 I didn't enlarge myself soon enough, but look, if you keep going, you'll see that I enlarged, uh, let's see here later on in the video, really later on. Okay. Uh, there we go. You see, I enlarged Gregory's, I enlarged our video because I didn't want to show everyone else. It shows active speaker. So because Gregory and I are both, um, spotlighted right now, Gregory is speaking. So he's the only one. I wish that we he could show both of us, but if I showed either the, um, if I showed either the thumbnail video or the grid, it would show everyone else who was on the call. So why is this happening? This is happening because like I showed you earlier, I expanded my video, right? And so Zoom started the entire recording, assuming that it had to make space for my larger video later. That's why earlier on it was, it had so much black space. And now later in the video, when I got smart about expanding it, it was now properly sized, uh, but it still has this empty space on the bottom, which I don't know anything. I don't think we can do anything about. If anyone else knows, please comment below. But uh, I hope this is helpful. I know this is a little bit of insider baseball for Zoom. But again, the key that I wanted to show you is um, is the show thumbnail video or the or the show active speaker only 
uh, that you should try clicking on. And if you click on this other one, hide thumbnail video, okay, let me go ahead and, and close this out. Hide thumbnail video. Uh, let me go ahead and share my regular screen. Then it hides you yourself as well. Um, it hides you yourself on Zoom. You can see this. My myself is on the bottom right because I'm recording a screencast, not using Zoom. But on Zoom, after the recording comes out, I would be hidden at that point. So I hope this is helpful. You might want to watch this again carefully to see what I'm up to. And uh, if you have any other tips for other Zoom users, you can comment below. Thanks. And thanks to Heather and Vix. Oh, let me show you. I, I promise to show you what happens when I, I've spotlight lighted myself, but let's say that I was also, you know, Heather was a fellow speaker. I can click on Heather's video and click add spotlight. And uh, now we're side by side. And when I share the, you know, um, so that's, that's how we, that's how we do that. So now I can click on her again. Uh, let's see, click on her again and click remove spotlight if I need to do that. So hope that helps and thank you so much.